So we get a call from our good buddy Spaz. Actually, the other day there, he wanted to go for a rip, and I broke an axle, so we're out. Spaz called me again today. I thought he was going to ask me to go for a rip. I'm going to say, oh, I'm all fixed up. She's good to go. And uh, nope. He blew an axle, so. Where she goes. So yeah. There she is. Yeah, I was just saying, last time you wanted to go for a ride and I'm broke. And then uh, I'm ready for a ride and you're broke. Yeah, here she is, boys. And I'd say she's. We can rip up to, to Sterling there. Trevor's the most local lad that uh, has something like that in stock, which is kind of nice. So we'll go up there and grab a demon replacement and that'll at least get you back on the trail, man. RJWC. There you go. Okay, so you just pull it. And these are severe duty. Okay, so when you're in the mud and shit like that, and the gravel and... Right on. Just like that. Mm -hmm. MTC. She like these tires, man. She's probably the easiest way to get more performance out of your bike. Should be the first thing to do. Then he's on the phone, he calls the wife and says, Trevor's got my Christmas present down here right now. Can I buy it? Hey, okay, let's get it. Hey, let's do it. Oh, right on. So, I'll show you And then you've got the weight. There we go. We'll see clutch kit. Got a couple more weights to stab in there, but uh, we'll get her installed. A thousand bucks later. A thousand bucks later, we're leaving dirty light. Just to confirm, you'd like to call Cody Fleer, mobile. Calling Cody Fleer, mobile. Oh, hey, I just got a clutch kit for my bike. Is there much to change in the clutch kit on a with player assist? Do, do you know what kit you want to put in that? Well, we just bought the QSC clutch kit, um, the full kit. So the primary is easier to do than the secondary. So the primary, I'm going to be able to take the face off of it like the QSC clutch, and it doesn't have that much tension, it's okay. Yeah, like it'll have tension. Yeah, I know. But if you back it both out equally. Yeah, yeah. equally and, and evenly. Yeah. Yeah. Now you'll put, there'll be, there'll be a shim that goes in there with the spring. Okay. And then in the secondary, make sure when you pop the secondary apart, there'll be on the back side, go. Yeah. There's an X, there's two axes to tell you that the sheaves, when you pull those sheaves apart, you yeah. gotta flip them 100, 180 from back together or it's balanced in a certain way. Oh, so they line it's, up uh, both sheaves, they have a, 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 a mark, okay. So you'll have to pop the secondary off. Yeah. Flip it over and on the back of the secondary, there's four bolts and there are four bolts. Now, what I recommend, and I tell a lot of people, you, a lot of guys will actually um, zip those fucking things because they lost sight them. Yeah. The back and out. Yeah. So either have a little mini torque there and just give it a little bit of heat. This yeah. is not a lot. A little bit of heat just to break the lock tape and loosen yeah. it up. It may not have tents on it, but you might. They go to put it back together with the new spring. It might have some little bit of pressure there. Well, that's what I was worried about is that having too much tension for us to get them back together. You can. I did mine without. Take two guys. That's what I figured. But I did mine by myself, so. Yeah, you better put her away. <laughs> she's got a little more lurch to it there. That's you just did that. Right? Hey. She wants to go sideways. Ashball, she just spun right. She'll spin out. Oh, the XF three tens won't work very well. Yeah, I think she's going to work pretty good for you, bud. I think you'll be pretty impressed. The whole performance of the QSC oh, for I'm sure. Now, mm. down the street. Only took a few of those, but. Uh, and a couple curse words yeah right on man oh my goodness what is so difference? well we'll take it out tomorrow and we'll give her yeah, a try man yeah, and we'll yeah. let you guys know what we think here it is boys we said we'd try her out we're back to do just that if i have to i can move it up a bit more but should we all go tire to tire we're off for a wrap
looks awesome, man. So what do you think of those tires? Or uh, the, the clutch? Well, it works great. It's working all right? Super. Yeah? Super. Okay, good. But like I haven't been holding it or anything. You know, no, you've been on and off and just, yeah. just working it through the sheaves, right? Been, good. Been 15 minutes over. Yeah, right on, right on. Yeah, we'll get them cool off a little bit. We're just gonna have some refreshments. This trail is awesome, this crush rock they're using. I don't know what it is, but I like it. and see what it's like yeah, kind of good. see what this is like feel for this i might be able to crawl through that not sure hey, I'll just tape you for me. all right sure yeah well you're already rocking eh? Yep. Out the other side of this or not? I'll give her a try though.
think I got her. dead too? It's blinking. Oh really? Yeah. You're still with us? Holy crap. I figured you guys died off back there somewhere. Well that's good. I don't know if you guys Shit, can see. We Is it really dirty or clean? No, a little muddy. Muddy. Well boys, that's it. What did you think of the, the clutch kit? Loved it. Yeah? Daylight and dark. Never Night and day, eh? Really? Yeah. Well, we'll have to get out again and get out in the field somewhere where we can see that thing engage real good with some traction. Yeah. But uh, it was just a smooth break in today, right? So, all right. Till the next one. Cheers.